This is very exciting. I finally, finally figured out how I'm going to do this tone arm. I had to take the other tone arm off. Everything's dry fitted right here. But I was like, how am I going to... Like, I had no idea. But anyhow, so what we got going on here, I tore apart this Audio Dynamics Corporation one. And I'm changing out the tone arm itself. And I'm modifying it. Like, I have a lot of these fiberglass fishing rod thingies. This is for people who make custom fishing rods. And they come in all kinds of sizes and stuff like that. Yes, I know, it's very dirty here. It's all dust. But this will be all cleaned up eventually. So I'm like, let's use this stuff. I'm not going to use it for fishing rods. So, sort of like a carbon fiber, right? It's fiberglass. So what we have going on here, I don't know the length that this is going to have to be yet. But this is really cool. Watch. I can slide it in and out once I find the distance of what I want it to be. Now, if I don't have enough weight on the back end, I'm going to have this so it slides out as well, in and out. I created this thing. Now, this was the original. It has to be all cleaned out, but this was the original that was on it. So what I did is these were motor mounts from the old turntable. And I used that on the inside. So this shaft, so it adds a little bit of isolation for vibrations. Now I'm gonna, I'll show you what I do with the other part of this later on. If I need more weight, I have the original weight that was inside of it, and that I can slide that in to there. If I have too much weight, I can take that off. Now there's screws that I can go on the bottom that'll hold the weight into place. And then that will just go into there. But I'm gonna have a, a screw that will co help control if I need to come out on that. This cool little thing that we're looking at right here that used to be up in here. Now if you know a fidget spinner, there's little fidget spinners on either side of this. Here you can see the fidget spinner there. And they go inside of this shaft here. So, see if I can focus here. Focus. Like that. Right? And of course there's two. There's another one there. You can see the fidgets. I call them fidget spinners, but because that's the same concept that it is. And then you have these screws right here. And they go in here. So I'm going to be modifying this arm so that I can get that shaft into it. And also for the tone arm wires will come up and feed down through the shaft. And you ask, how am I gonna get the cartridge onto this? That, I have an idea, but we'll have to wait till the end to see if it actually works out. So that's an update. I, I'm, I'm really happy with this. I've been struggling with figuring out how I'm going to do this tone arm and I finally figured it out. So I'm really looking forward to getting this thing finally done. Here you can see I took a platter from another turntable but it wasn't that small. So how did I get it that way you ask? Well this is the original and that was basically the bottom side what a pain it was to cut that out I don't I didn't have the tools for a tried jigsaw tried everything but it was a belt fibbing from the inside of the other turntable platter well we're gonna have the motor mounted here with some really nice 
rubber mounts. Those other holes are where the buttons are going to be and the knobs. And we're going to have the belt on the outside. This is the spindle I'm going to be using. It's a different kind of spindle. It has, uh, it's kind of, it's an inverted spindle. But it's really nice. It works for this. So, this is the update so far on building or modifying. This is the motor, as you can see. Everything's messy around here, but trust me, I will get this sucker working and it's gonna be great. Now that I know that I can finally figure out how I'm gonna do this tone arm. So next time you see this, it will be completed. Even though this is a winter project, I think I'm gonna be finished within the next couple weeks. So stay tuned to see how it turns out. Thank you for watching guys. Cheers.